Could a hotel be replacing the historical Jeter building? Find out next on Falcon Weekly. Many buildings surrounding Montevallo's main quad are known for their age and historic nature. There's Reynolds, Palmer, and Napier, to name a few. But Jeter Hall, the university's former social sciences building, might be reaching its age limit. Located near the entrance of the university on the corner of North Boundary and Oak Street, Jeter is being considered as a spot for a new hotel. The university's vice president of business affairs, Deanna Smith, explains that the Jeter site might not look the same, though. The Jeter building is, of course, in really bad shape, and so we've had several architects look at it, and they um, all feel like it's a pretty cost-prohibitive project to, to try and renovate and repurpose that building into a hotel. So that is one of the reasons why we might consider taking it down. While demolition of the building is being considered for any new structure that might be here, there are some who think that taking this building down is a necessity. It was quite stark to see once you moved out of the building, any of the few nice possessions we had, what was left in there was little short of atrocious. University professor of history Clark Holtquist, who now teaches in UMOM, the new social sciences building, remembers the condition of Jeter personally. Sitting in the basement doing my work like I'm doing now, I could look at sort of half windows up there and watch people's ankles go by. And it was a little bit dirty, a little bit grubby, and I think not particularly good for my voice or my throat in the basement. Despite the desire for a new building, there are still plans to honor the historical nature of the old building. What the plan is, is to take some of the brick from the building and maybe the portico or some other features and to memorialize that inside the hotel. For Falcon Weekly, I'm Max Green reporting.